Hey, this is Timo from OnlineBuilderGuy.com and in this video we are going to take a look how to work with blank landing pages in Thrive Architect. Now, uh, it all starts by going to your WordPress admin panel, uh, going to pages and then clicking add new. Yeah, this is a very standard way of creating pages in WordPress. So let me just create uh, a new static page by naming it my uh, static uh, page and then clicking save draft and once that's done the next thing to do is to click edit with thrive architect button so uh, let me just click it here and it is going to take a little while until Thrive Architect loads the page, so let me just pause the video for a brief moment. Okay, great. So the page has been loaded. Um, I think that I have some issues with my Chrome, especially with AdBlock uh, extension, and that's the reason why it takes uh, a little bit longer to load uh, the editing mode so that's I, why I wanted to pause the video temporarily because I do not want to bore you with with the page loading animation of <laughs> Thrive Architect anyways we have now created a regular WordPress page and it's in Thrive Architect's edit mode and the next thing to do is to access the landing page options uh, of Thrive Architect and you can do it either by clicking uh, the page setup at the bottom so you can see under the page template uh, sorry under under the template setup heading you will see these different landing page related options or by clicking the gear icon on the top left and you will see the same template setup and then you can also access these landing page related options now the next thing to do is to choose a landing page template and in this case we want to use the blank uh, landing page if for any reason uh, you feel that none of these predefined landing pages are for you then you can create your own landing page by uh, clicking the landing page blank page uh, set and then choosing it and then choose template and it says that template has been changed successfully and it is going to take a little while until Thrive Architect uh, loads the page. Uh, so uh, let me just pause the video briefly. Okay, great. So the page has been loaded. Uh, now the next thing to do is well, you start creating your own masterpiece and you do it by choosing any of these elements on 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 the left here by dragging and dropping them to this canvas, to this blank canvas here. And let me just create a very silly looking landing page uh, by tracking some elements here and then saving it as a template. So let me just choose a heading and... Uh, name it as my landing page heading and then with Thrive Architect uh, let me just show it again so uh, this is basically the the uh, regular view when you start editing your page but once you have chosen any of your elements uh, this left side menu changes and then you can basically change any of these settings here so for instance you could like increase the font size and do some other fancy stuff uh, but anyway I, I won't go into that any any further detail because I have explained all of this uh, in my Thrive Architect review that's on my blog and you can access it by clicking the link below this video anyway uh, let me just add a couple of other elements here let me just add some paragraph or add a paragraph and name it like this and let me just add a third element which is a lead generation element and drag it here and so we have a very professional looking <laughs> professional looking landing page so the next thing to do is to save it and you do it by clicking clicking the gear icon uh, 
uh, template setup and then saving landing page and then naming it as my silly landing page so I guess this describes the best what's going on here and then you click save and the page template has been successfully saved okay so the next thing to do is uh, is that let's say that you have started a new project and then you want to uh, take advantage of this this uh, template that you have just saved so let me just create a new page uh, I will pause this video once again briefly and I will do some some certain steps like creating a new page and saving in as a draft and all this stuff and then I will get back to you and we continue with this video okay great so I created this new page and I want to uh, take advantage of the landing page that I, I have just saved before creating this my saved landing page page so uh, all I have to do is by going to the gear icon and then uh, going to template setup and choose a landing page template and then under saved landing pages you will see all the pages that you have saved so far so in my case I have done a couple of tests before this video but here is my my silly landing page so let me just click here and click choose template and once again Thrive Architect uh, uh, is loading the content on the screen and I will get back to you very briefly once that's okay great so we have finally loaded the page and this is the very same page that we saved before uh, doing the initial first landing page or the static page in in this in this situation anyway uh, this was a demonstration related to creating uh, brand new landing pages with Thrive Architect. So thanks for watching and watching, and I will get back to you soon. Bye bye.